explicit violence and gore. Gore. Oh god, this opening. Yeah. Capcom. Every time I see that, I think I'm about to play Mega Man. Every time I see it, I think I'm about to play Breath of Fire 3. Oh shit, okay. Yeah. It's a game I played a lot. Oh, oh, oh! God, I love that opening. Man. So, <laughs> welcome! Uh, today in the gamer chair, we've got my good friend Matt. Uh, hey, how's it going? Going well. Uh, I'm Derek, and looks like we're about to play some good old Resident Evil Director's Cut. Also known as Learn to Walk the Game. <laughs> you like tank controls? The answer is no, no one likes tank controls, but we're going to do it. So, yeah. so go ahead and hit start, and we'll get this started. Be smart. Fighting foes isn't the only way to survive. This, this horror, is, horror. This horror. Wow, that. Uh, did you, right, right, never mind. Yeah, that's just a. That's just yeah, a cut in. Yeah, it's just a cut in. Now here's the real question, Matt. Okay. Uh, I don't know. You, you can skip it. Um, to anyone who hasn't played this game, we get we get two options of characters. Go ahead. Yeah, here we go. We'll, we'll new game it. New let's, game it. Let's just. Oh God. I. That's not a range. No, a range is terrible. Let's we'll, do we'll original. Do original. Because we're not Resident beginners. Evil. We will look like beginners, but oh, that's we, only because... The, the question here is, do we do Chris Redfield? Jesus, slow down. Chris no. Redfield. <laughs> look at that face. He's like... Uh, Chris uh. Redfield. He got the memo to not smile during his Police Academy picture. Yeah. We, we also have Jill Valentine, who has a very stoic expression. She doesn't really have any emotion on that face. Yeah. So, so right now, what we're choosing is: do we want inventory space or biceps? <laughs> I I don't know, man. What, what are you feeling? Mm, let's. We have the master of unlocking on one hand. That's true. The master of unlocking, or a guy who can just knife things better. He's got he's got some other upsides. Uh, yeah. What do you think? I, I'm personally partial to Jill Valentine. So am I, because the, the lockpick is nice, but even better is inventory space in this game. That inventory space is is just helpful. Nineteen ninety eight. Raccoon Forest. Alpha God, I love the. Oh wait, we got voices. Northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle. It was like watching my uh, my dad hold the <laughs> the VHS recorder. Bizarre murder cases. Bizarre murders. Committed in Raccoon City. Look at that guy. He doesn't look innocent. He doesn't. Horror and raccoon. More victims <laughs> death. <laughs> the horror. Well, raccoons are horrifying sometimes. <laughs> The Special Tactics and Rescue Service, also known as STARS. There's some more people talking. That was, that was super realistic grass. Here we go, wandering through the weeds. You can tell they just took a camcorder and just shot some grass with the camcorder right now. Yeah. They didn't animate this. It was Bravo Team's helicopter. Nobody was in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. <laughs> <laughs> Sunglasses at night. <laughs> Only an asshole would do that. An asshole named Wesker. Look at that scowl. <laughs> and I hate grass. I really hate grass. Hey, come here. Oh man, it's uh, it's the dog from the Sandlot. <laughs> <laughs> that dog is terrifying. Both the dog from Sandlot and this dog. The grass was armed. That reaction is amazing. <laughs> wow, this opening. I haven't... Her, her mouth did not say Joseph. Also, she just stood there. Now they're running. Man. <laughs> <laughs> but 
Ben's left us in the grass to die. Oh man, this opening. Oh, high steps, man. I mean, they're in tall grass. You gotta do those high steps. Brett! Those rapid cuts noises. That is something. They really love that dog's cast. cast. Oh, this is my favorite part right here. It's Chris so... Chris Redfield. I... Like, I really wish that the Resident Evil movie had these people. That would be amazing. I wish I could have been one of these people. I wish I could be Barry. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that Barry. Don't film me. Albert Wesker. I wear sunglasses at night. He's, Albert Wesker is done with this shit. Albert Wesker is in a constant state of done with this shit. They have escaped into the mansion where they thought it was safe. Yet. Oh, that's it. Okay. What is this? Wow. What a mansion. What a mansion. What, what is this? Look at the difference on that upscaler. Captain Wesker, where's Chris? That's impressive. Stop it. Don't, Don't open, open that door. door. <laughs> I love how wild their feet are. <laughs> they What is it? Oh, there we go. That's one for the what is it count. That's actually two already. I'm going with you. Chris is our old partner, you know. Those are emotions. That's how people talk. Let me handle this. It's a known fact when you're talking, if you're not trying to smack the air ghosts, then you're not really doing it right. You gotta Stay smack the words. Door. Door. Here it is. The the classic clock. A dining room. Dining room. <laughs> oh, this will be a fun. Oh one. no! Oh crap! <laughs> oh no! Oh, this is gonna be great. To anyone who hasn't played this game before, moving is as hard as it looks, and it's actually harder than that. You operate with all the dexterity of right. a tank. Right, you might want to use the D-pad. That might make things a little easier. What? What, what is this? That's a third one. That's a third. What is this? What is it? Blood. Four. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. Now we got a friend in chat. Hope this is not Chris's blood. I hope it's not Chris's blood. Uh huh. Yes. The tank controls. There we go. All right. That's the. the is, is the that's the feel I gotta get. I gotta do. I gotta do the spins. Is the D-pad a little easier to use than the analog stick? Like a little. <laughs> uh. There we go. All right. Gotta, gotta love this game. Synonymously known as one of the worst voice acted games ever. It is, it is an absolute delight run. though. And we'll get our first... First Zambor. Zambor. He's so, he's so ashy. Hello in the air. Hello. Do you have your gun equipped? Because you might not. No, I don't. You should probably do that. Nope. You're actually just gonna leave and not fight him, right? Yep. That's the very thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not wasting my bullets this early. I need oh, those. No. Oh no. Oh no. You save all your ammo. Barry? Barry? What is, what is it? <laughs> that's the third what that's the fourth what is it? Let me take care of this. Man. What is it? <laughs> Too. That's the that's the fifth? <laughs> yeah, that's the fifth. Uh, okay. But go back to that zombie or that, that body first. Oh yeah. yeah. Extra ammo. Let's go ahead and do our little 
Oh, you got to report this to Wesker oh, first. I don't want to talk to Wesker right now. No, that's okay. You can go back and uh, inspect the go. body. I'm, I'm, I'm getting the movement better now. <laughs> oh, it is not an easy thing to control. Mm. Not, not if you haven't played in a while. Wesker! Wesker! Help me look for him, Jill. And don't leave his hall for the time being. Okay, now you can go back and check that body. I'll go back and check it out in a minute. Because remember, you you also get your first... Uh, first ink ribbon. Ink ribbon. Oh, okay, ink. apparently there's no time to check no, the I think, I think you have. What do you have to do first? I don't remember. Yeah, you just gotta walk around and inspect the crap. I think you have to go upstairs and go yeah. downstairs. And we get the... We get to watch the uh, graphic for going up steps, which confounds me sometimes. Well, you, it's like, you look... Do you not look straight down when you go upstairs? No. Well, it's even worse when you go down the stairs, because it feels like I'm just going to fall. <laughs> ah, no. Damn it, Jill. Let's go up. Go up the steps. Thank you. Jill moves with all the dexterity of a 90-year-old tank. A 90-year-old in a tank. You can't run. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. If you're not moonwalking, you're not doing it right. Do you have to check the doors? Uh, what a mansion! Maybe you just go up the stairs and go down the stairs. Yeah, you just, you just have to go up here and check look at the that, look at that Look at that picture, though. <laughs> it's like, mmm. Mm. That, raised, that raised chin. There we go. See how far she leans back when she goes down some steps? Right? Here we go. Yeah, this this is the part where it's it just trips me out. Because if I'm looking down steps like this, I feel like I'm just going to go <laughs> face first. <laughs> Find anything, Jill? Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. I can't figure it out at all. It's me too. Now it's Wesker's time to disappear. I don't know what's going on. Well, it can't be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay, I'll try the door on the opposite side. Oh, thank you. This mansion is gigantic. How would you know? You haven't been in any room other than the dining room in the hall. We should start from the first floor, okay? And Jill, here's a lockpick. Well, you forgot what to say there. And... Uh, Here's a lockpick. He he had to look at the script real quick. Thanks. Yeah, it's, it's where the script had, it ended. It was like, and... Turn, turn page. page. <laughs> Jill. <laughs> Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Remember, remember everyone, you're not really talking unless you smack the air. Smack the air while you're talking. Teach the air business. Get follow him though. You, you gotta get that extra ammo. Yeah. Now, now I can search the ribbon. Yeah, but don't use it yet. Oh no, it's too early. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> Will you take ink ribbon? Yeah, I'll take the ribbon. Let's see. Got a equipment knife. Combat knife. You gotta assume the position. Yeah. Uh, there you go. Remember, make sure you know how to stab before you run to the first zombie. I never understood the upward stab. It's, it's so you can kill the bats and stuff. No, you just run past bats. Well, I mean, yeah, you do, but... Do it like that so you can. I love how he's like, here, use this, and then Jill goes, okay, I'll use this. This this game this game is a monument to how conversations don't sound. Take this thing. I'll use the thing. It's your friend. It's, it's Kenneth. Kenneth. 
from the Stars Bravo team. Now he's become a mere shadow of his former self. Inspect him again. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't know if I'd really call him that he's a shadow of, of his former self, because he's just dead. Yeah. He, he just dead. Doesn't he have one more? Yeah. Yep. Woe to anyone who didn't check his body for those 330 ammo. That is a lot in this game. The 330 ammo? The, the free, the free 30 ammo. Like, like, I know that's supposed to be his head right there, but I mean... <laughs> I mean, I guess it did get chewed up a bit, so... Yeah, yeah. Well, the real question is, zombies eat brains, why did the zombie go straight for his neck? Well, no, I mean, you, you're thinking... You're thinking classic Night of the Living Dead zombies. That's true. Those, until then... It's locked. Like, zo zombie, th that's where, like, the whole, oh, zombies eat brains thing came from is because of those movies. Yeah, that's true. You have used the lockpick. Oh, right. Now it's good. Let's open this door. It's a very fancy door. Looks nice. Uh, yes. Real, zo know. real zombies do just want to eat people. They, they got the hunger. They got the hunger. They just... Mm, 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 mm. They got the nummies. They must feed. Piano. Don't you go get the sheet music? Yeah, I gotta go find the sheet there. music first. Isn't it right there in the... You push that? But you don't want to do all this stuff yet. You need to get the the uh, emblem oh, from great. the dining room. You just I think you just walk into it. That's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Damn it. God, I, I suck. <laughs> I believe in you. There we are. Womp, 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 paper. Will you take the music notes? I mean, I can just take it to the piano and just leave it there. I'm gonna play it. No, you have to use music notes, man. That's right, I have to go into the menu and select... To use. Use. It's Moonlight Sonata. I love the graphic of her arm clipping through the, her shoulder pads. <laughs> It's they. To be fair, this game looks pretty good for how old it is. Not so much the character models; they uh, they look they don't look fantastic. But the backgrounds. My God, a secret door! But remember, if you grab that, you'll get trapped. You're right. So what you gotta go do is you gotta go get the the emblem from the dining room. Yeah, I should, which I should, I should have already grabbed anyway. Yeah, it's okay. It's hard to remember pool. all that stuff. Oh, I'm gonna run into the walls. There we go. There you go. Emblem. Will you take the emblem? Now we go back to piano room and get that emblem. And we get the true emblem. <laughs> yeah, what would have happened if she didn't know how to play the piano? You just never get to progress. I guess so, yeah, because I mean... If you're playing as uh, Chris and you go in there, Chris is just like, I don't know what to do with a piano. <laughs> I don't know how to read music. To be fair, I, as myself, do not know how to read music. Uh, yeah, but thankfully you have, um... Oh, God. Oh, we, uh, she was in the opening credits. What was, what was the girl's she, name? Rebecca Chambers. Rebecca. How dare you forget Rebecca? I, I, I will always forget Rebecca. Sweet, innocent Rebecca Chambers. Boop. Oh, no! Oh, locked in. It's the hollow that an emblem was in. Oh, man. Gotta love how slow this game scrolls text. It's not as slow as the text for tactics, though. I mean, yeah. That's only for, like, the chapter cutscenes. Yeah. There we go. And now we never need to come back to this room. But, I mean... But, I mean... 
I mean, that is the truth. If she honestly didn't know how to use the piano, because you don't get Rebecca with when you play as Jill. Yeah. Well, it's a good thing this is a video game, and it's made to... Uh, it's made in a way in which you advance from one room to the next. If, if she couldn't play the piano, though, you'd literally never get anywhere in this mansion. Yeah. The real question Whoa. is... Is how does Barry and everyone else travel through this mansion? Because Barry doesn't have keys. I understand that, you know, there's the whole Wesker reveal that, oh, he was the bad guy, but... Is that Mussolini in that painting? That might... <laughs> that possibly? That could just be Mussolini. Will you take mansion, mansion key? key? But remember... What are we gonna do with that mansion key? I'm gonna look at it. That's you know, what I'm gonna do. You, gonna, you mean check? God. <gasps> There's a shield on it. Carving of a shield. Now it is shield key. <laughs> oh, you did get a spoiler. <laughs> look at you. Yeah, uh, sorry for spoilers, uh, Mobby. If you, uh, if you haven't played this game that came out... Uh, 15 years ago, probably, to this day? You shut your mouth. If you've never seen a Resident Evil movie in your life, or played any Resident Evil game, I apologize for the spoilers. <laughs> Wesker is indeed not a good man. I went with the assumption that anyone who's watching this video has probably already seen a Resident Evil movie. You know what happens when you assume. That's true. I make an ass out of me and Umption. Umption's a nice guy. Yeah. Oh. It's, it's locked. Carving of an armor. Not not armor. A an armor. An armor. Carving of an armor. One singular armor. <laughs> uh, we'll go through the blue doors. Oh. Look at that, that thing. That's a crazy statue. You gotta, you gotta push that thing. Push that ladder, that step stool. Oh, Do we want to go to that back room? There's an ink ribbon, but there's also a zombie. Don't you have to put it, push it flush with the... Like, so you're facing the back of the urn? I thought it was the front. I could be wrong. Oh wow, our, our viewer just told us it's not not 15 years old, it's 22 years old. Dear, dear lord. That makes me feel old. Wow. That, that's upsetting. Push, push things with your shoulders, people. That's how it works. Yeah, you gotta use your legs. <laughs> use your right, legs and okay, thank God. force the entire thing with your shoulders. Please don't change it to camera angle. No, god damn it. <laughs> Alright, there. There you go. You just gotta... I'm gonna go here. <laughs> uh, I apologize. Our, our viewer is actually another another good friend and person here at our New Game Plus team. Uh, Josh is, is, is in here providing excellent commentary. Thank you. Thank you, Josh. You are you are more than a friend. So are we are we going to this back room? You gotta go to the back room. I mean, I suppose. <laughs> Stagger stepping, always entertaining. That's the frightened walk. Don't forget he's alive. Stab him in the brain. Get close and then stab him in the brain. Assume the position. Go for it. Oh, oh, oh. I wasn't close enough. What? Oh no! You still got me! <laughs> you know, luckily you kicked off his head. I I disagree with that. Do you wanna do you wanna put on gun for this guy that's gonna come up? Or are you just gonna knife him? I don't know. I love the knife in other games, but I am oh, not yeah, I'm I'm not spe well. I'm not spectacular with a knife in this game, I will admit. There, there are certain situations that call for just the knife. When they're on the ground, or when they're, like, staggered, then the knife is good. Does the zombie not come around, or is that is that in Chris's I'm thinking of? Because I thought one comes comes towards you. 
No, I must be thinking of an in Chris's game where one where you grab the. Oh yeah, because in Chris's game there's a key back there. Yeah. That's right. I'm misremembering. You have used the lockpick. Brown door. Also spooky door. Every door in this game is the spooky door. Now, oh. there is something underneath one of these things, right? Or is that another one? I might be thinking... Check them. We might be thinking of... We, we recently, and when I say recently, I mean a few years ago, played the, the PS4 remake of this game, and it has some additional things added to it. I think right. that was the one where there's a... Something underneath that. Yeah. But I also know that this is the hallway of just run. Oh yes, just keep running. Shoot. Never try fighting dogs in this game, it's just a bad experience. Yeah, that one looks like you can push it, but we're not gonna do that right now. Shoot. <laughs> the dogs in this game are terrifying, and you will either waste all of your ammo or take a lot of hits trying to trying to fight them. Jesus, that's fate. <laughs> She's like, are you sassing me? <laughs> She didn't appreciate that, Matt. She was not having any of that. Uh -huh. You're, in ca you're in caution. I, I can take one more hit. I don't know. We haven't saved yet. Oh my god, you're right. I wanna, you might just want to eat that herb. Yeah. There we go. Now, right, now I'm fine. Now we're fine. We're good. Aaron, the side of caution. Resident Evil 1 is not an easy game. Carving of an, an armor. armor. One more singular armor. Yes, this is uh, this is the, the the PS3. This is actually a PS1 copy, but we are playing this with a graphical upscaler, so the the detailing does look quite a bit better. It's pretty noticeable. Oh, this isn't that bathtub. No, that's a later bathtub that you drain. I, I don't remember if there's actually anything in this room for Jill. No, nothing useful. I don't even think there's a surprise zombie in this room. I think it's just a... Of course, I could be wrong. Yeah, that doesn't. I don't see any blinkies, though. We'll, nope, nothing. We'll, we'll check this later. Red painting. Which door are we going in? We're going into this one. Is this is this where you room where you become a Jill sandwich? <laughs> this Jill sandwich. Is he's supposed to say Jill sandwich, but I swear he says Jibble. Yeah, it's Jibble's sandwich. The the voice acting in this game is not spectacular, but the best thing about it is it is a whole a whole fun to make fun of. Was the smoking lounge with the shotgun on the wall? Clearly not trapped. Will you take the shotgun? Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna take the shotgun. I like how, ironically enough, the like inventory pixels for the shotgun have better graphic detail than the big picture of the shotgun when it was zooming towards you. slow-moving ceiling. Da -na -na. Gotta check the door. It's, it's locked. locked! Gonna check the other door. It's locked. Gonna check the door again. Oh no, what do we do? To be fair, if you're playing Chris, you just you just get a game over. Hey, what's going on? Jill? Is that you, Jill? Slap the door, Barry. I'm gonna kick this door down. Hurry! This way! Hurry! This way! Smack the air! Run through that open door! <laughs> oh, Barry! Oh, Barry! That was too close. You were almost a jibble sandwich. Jibble. He says jibble. You were almost a jibble sandwich. Those arm motions. Calm down, girl. <laughs> uh, I 
just had something I wanted to check. Now, let's get back to searching for the lost captain and Chris, shall we? <clears throat> it's, it's like it's like they're like, what do people do with their arms when they're talking? Barry. Oh, Barry! Good old Barry. To the rescue. Let's go! I forget, does this lead us back to dining room? No. Oh god. He's not dead. He's not dead till he bleeds. Oh, he's bleeding. Oh, okay, you, good. You good. I wasted that shot, but... You're okay. <laughs> I gotta be safe. Oh god. Oh, he's lost. He can't find you. I always, uh... Jesus, dude. Good God, just die, man. He, I, can't, he, I can't tell if he's bleeding. I can't tell if he's bleeding. Do it. Do a stab. Assume the position. No, you die. Die, damn it. <laughs> it's okay, we saved some ammo. Thank God for the knife. Like, that first zombie went down, like, four shots. That one, like, it, it took several hits to kill that it one. It took six shots to fall down and then three stabs to die. Let me combine. It's it's combin, combin, combin. Gotta use my combin on my my ammo. You unlocked it. Cool. Oh, well, thank God. Whoa. Gray door. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Let's <laughs> not let's not do that. <laughs> that was that was white shirt zombie. Yeah, knife is not good for white shirts. What was this? It's locked. A uh, carving of a helmet. A helmet. See, that says a helmet, not an helmet. Well, yeah. an armor can yeah. kind of make sense. Yeah. Because, I mean, there's several types of armor. Metal door. This leads you to the outside. Now we're on the outside. Oh no. Oh no. No, we don't want to be here anyways. This uh, this is where we come once we get all of the crest, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. We'll, we'll, we'll come back here later. Can we can we find a save? I would really like a save at some point. That's what I'm trying to find. But I know... I don't think there's one in here. Like, I think... Oh, pull up the this map. Is, this is the Raven Room, right? This is, is this the painting room? Yep. Yeah. We can do this real quick. Welcome to the room. Let's pause. This room can either be terrifying or really simple. Ah. What we got to do is we got a bunch of paintings throughout life, and we're looking uh, an for the, man. the order in which... Uh, that's not one first. No. But I was clicking on it because yeah, there it is. shows you that there's a there's switch. There's a switch. No, I will not click that button. What is this one? That's a lively, a lively boy. boy. No. No. I gotta go, I gotta go find the baby. Is that it? Oh, a newborn baby. I believe newborn babies first, but let's check the other ones first. I mean I would I would hope newborn baby was first. I mean, tired middle-aged man. Oh no, 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 no! Don't want to hit yes. Do not. Do not do that. And then that one is him going to heaven. From a cradle to grave. Okay, so we're gonna do newborn baby. Was was one of them infant? Newborn. Yes. <laughs> Look at the wing detail, actually, on that. That's surprising. Yeah, what is that? The crows are nice. What is that one that looks like it's on a like a papyrus scroll? Young man. There's okay, young man. I don't think it's I don't think it's young man next. Lively boy would be before young man. Uh, an infant would be next. Yes. Like it says an infant, but like, like to me, it looks like. A lady with short black hair and a red dress, and, like, she is just, like, kneeling down. Like, she's just like, I'm fucking tired, please leave me alone. Yeah, that's what it kind of looks like. But it's definitely, it's definitely infant. 
Uh, one of them was Lively Boy, right? Yeah, which is this one. Which I guess I can see. Like, I see his leg. He yeah. looks like a creeper. He definitely looks like a creeper. Uh, and then I think I think young man, then uh, then then middle Tired, aged, middle-aged. and then bold old, bold and old. You know, it's like they say. Not all wise people are old, <laughs> but all old people are wise. Me do. Me do. Me. Me do. Oh yeah, no. No. Oh no 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 no! I've already pushed that. I'm gonna no. do this. There we go. It's a tired middle-aged man. And now we need bold and old. Just says that's what his infancy was like. <laughs> Be- being a short, black-haired, uh, red-dressed girl kneeling down. <laughs> also, this picture... It, it look, I always see, like, a weird, like, grandma with, like, a bonnet kind of deal. Well, no, I can clearly tell it's an old man with a beard. It's it's Santa oh, Claus. Oh, yeah, it is he's, a beard. He's checking his list. He also could be, like, a Pisco demon from Final Fantasy Tactics. Just the, the, the goop hanging down. Oh, God. The end of life. There's a switch. Da-na-na-na. Oh, no. We did it. Sun. Oh, it's the star. I thought it was the sun. Star crest. Well, I'm technically not wrong. True. Yeah, yeah. The sun is indeed a star. Yeah, if you push those in the wrong order, those crows murder you. I don't know if you can classify them as a murder of crows. There is five of them, but they will... No, there's more. There's a lot more. No, mur- I mean, yeah, that's, that's still technically a murder. Yeah. Not only are they a murder, but they will give you murder. They will kill you. They'll kill yeah. you dead. It's It goes crow, then when you hit two, it's attempted murder, and then more than two is a murder. I didn't realize that two was called an attempted murder. That's pretty hilarious. Uh, can we get to a save point? Uh, sure. Pull, pull up in your map. I, I, I would hate to lose all this progress. I, I think you gotta... First floor... Bump. If you go down the stairs to your left, isn't that a? Uh... Isn't, yeah, this is save room at the. Isn't there a save room right there? The yeah, let's go there. I'm trying to figure. Out. Okay, that door, that door. Oh, we have to get past white coat zombie. <laughs> oh no, that's okay. We can do this. Uh, I'm gonna have to gun this. Yeah. Also, Jill's nose is fierce. I just realized. It hangs out noticeably far from her, from her, the rest of her face <laughs> on that side view. Quick, knife! Oh, no, he's bleeding. Is he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw the bleed. It was hard to tell because of the cover, but I definitely saw it. I don't, I don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta check. Yeah. I understand. There you go. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. He's, he's dead. Sometimes the bleed is hard to see, but if you see them bleed, that's how you know you killed the zombie. You are out of inventory space, sir. Oh no. But luckily this room has a uh, a storage thing, doesn't it? Yeah. It should. If I'm remembering this game correctly. I, mo- most of the save rooms have the infinite chest. Oh wait, is this the room with the save? Or is that the other? Yeah, this is. No, okay. yeah. It's just, welcome to the under the stairs cupboard. It's a surprisingly big room. Yeah, see? There's the infinite trunk. There's the chemicals. The chemicals. Go ahead and go in that trunk and uh, let's put away... Let's put away the crest. The crest. Put the crest away. Grab those clips. Uh, do we want to hold on to the shotgun or put the shotgun away for now? Actually, I'll... I'll well, we're, we're going to want to save. Save, first. save and then we'll put the ink ribbons away. But for now... Um, there we go. Combine those clips. Here we go. I'm Let's put the shotgun away. Put the shotgun up for now. Ah. I forgot that I wanted to get one more thing. Yeah, grab, grab the other clip. And then combine all three clips. We'll have a good amount of ammo here to work with. Combin. Combin the clips together. 
I'm glad that that's an option. Yeah, this game would be impossible if it wasn't. Might as well go ahead and refill that. You can save your progress with this. Will you use the ink ribbon? Yep. Also, those ink ribbons do not have much ink in them if it requires all of the ink. Well, Matt, I believe this has been a good episode. Yeah, I think I think we've done as much as we can for right now. Did some, some real good progress. I think uh, we didn't die, which is great. Um, we got we got one of the crests, we got a key, and we killed some zombies. And you're doing a little whirly wind spin there. You, you gotta you gotta do the whirly wind spin. If if this isn't how you move, then you've clearly mastered more things than me. You might want to grab that chemical and throw it in the chest, and then we'll call this episode uh, call this episode done. Yeah, that's a good idea. Chemical. By the way, yes, people, that's right. Saves are an item in your inventory space, and you can run out of saves, and it is awful. This is survival horror, to quote the opening to this game. Throw the ink ribbons in there, too. That's a good idea. There we go. All right, we're going to cut the episode here and see where this adventure takes us next time.